What is the address of your emergency? Aaron Watson, Michael Wells. His laughter resounds in our memory, his charm forever imprinted in our hearts. Six victims. Christopher Vardy. Chris was one of my first cousins on the mother's side of the family. Their names? William D. Williams. These were people that were on their way to work and never came home. Their families left behind. I was dreading this day to the depth of my core. Tiffany Jared. The thought of facing this day literally made me nauseous. Yeah, I got underneath the 18 wheeler. Friday marked the first anniversary of the deadly I-35 pileup. And Tamara Mendoza. Her memory will always be with me. One year ago. Black ice covered the express lanes of I-35, resulting in the horrific crash involving nearly 130 vehicles. You're still in there? Fort Worth Fire Department body cam. Can you call out if I break this window? Is difficult to watch. I got something that's going to get you out of there, man. A scene that big, I, I'd never seen anything like that. I pray to God I'd never seen anything like that again. Families of the victims joined the Fort Worth Police and Fire Departments at the anniversary ceremony, where the city declared Friday, Fort Worth First Responders Day. Myself personally, I had uh, hands on every victim that was in this accident. To show appreciation to the first responders, like James Bennett Jr. of Beards Towing, Tiffany Jared's loved ones started the organization FW211. This is how she would just want to give back and just be a positive light in the community. Giving supplies and handwritten notes. I, I'm sure she is proud and loving every minute of this. To those who rushed the scene. I didn't know the backstory. I didn't know what they actually looked like in physical presence. And uh, so today was a pretty emotional day for everybody involved. For me and from the Tiffany Jared family, we say thank you to our first responders. In Fort Worth, I'm Ariel Placencia.